This is the moment we've all been waiting for for literally years at this point. I finally got my uh, Cocoon headphones, so uh, I'll be unboxing it today. I have not opened it at all, um, and I'm going to try pairing it to my phone. Launch edition. Oh, it doesn't slide up, it opens up. Oh, this is beautiful. So you got a quick start guide baked into the box itself. The headphones come in a case. Inside the box you also have uh, manual, probably warranty information, safety information. Side. I'm so excited. Ugh, oh, beautiful. So inside of the actual case, you get the promised headgear, the cocoon itself. First impressions, very lightweight. It feels like a pillow. So that's, that's promising. Get a little better view. Right and left, you can see the insides, how that looks. And then what else is in here? We also have and get some charging cables. Oh, we've got the headphone cable, of course, with the inline mic and yep, the charging cable. So all in all, in the box inside, you get the case. What the case looks like. It's got a soft inside with a pocket. You get covers, eye cover, cables, oh, and the beautiful headphones. Super soft. It looks like it's got, the, it's got an outer soft ring and then an even softer leathery inside. See the contacts are they actually wiggle. I don't know if that's visible, but they, they're super soft. It's, it's odd to say a metal plastic object is soft to the touch, but I guess they've got it set in there in a way that makes it comfortable on the ears, my guess. It's got this beautiful, nice touch. The finish the name shines brightly, and it twists around quite a bit. So let's see how it actually pairs with the phone. Got this all set up. Gonna have to find the, oh, it looks like this right here. Yeah, we've got some, we've got a little power button. Oh, that's visible. A little power button right there. It looks like an audio jack there. And then the micro USB plug and I'm guessing some sort of function button. So we have Bluetooth. Power this baby on. Maybe it doesn't ship with power. I might have to charge these up a little bit before I can use them. And we're back. I got my I've got a color theme going on by accident. My anchor power block. We're gonna see how. Oh, God. It's a fairly short cable. You might be able to see that right there. Should be interesting for charging it, but I guess you're not supposed to be wearing it while you're charging it, so that shouldn't be an issue. Oh, we get a little bit of sign of life. 
blinking light on this end. Let's see if it'll turn on now. I'm gonna go with no. I'll give it a bit to charge. It turns out that reading the instructions was important. So in the quick start guide, uh, you actually are supposed to charge the headphones uh, with the include cable until the LED light shows uh, solid green. Um, I gave it a little bit of charge and we're going to see if that was enough. And then you're supposed to disconnect from the power source and then hold the uh, power button for one second to turn them on. You see the LED will turn a solid white. And then the action button is on the right hand side for three seconds to enter pairing mode. Alright, that solid light just came on, and now I've got a blinking blue light, Let's see if it pops up, Cocoon Relax shows up, Let's see that. yeah, the Cocoon Relax. Alright, connects really quickly, we'll open up the app. There we go. All right. So you have to create an account in order to actually use this. So we're going to have to do that. We'll take a break. I just created my account. Uh, you have the option to either uh, sign in through Facebook or create an account. Be careful if you just create your account because it asks for your email address and your password. There's no second password confirmation uh, option. So you have to make sure you get it right the first time. Then you're gonna have to put in your age, put in some information. Six, male, female, male. Next. Get a little visual. So we open it up, and we'll see what we get. We get a featured item, introductory sessions, I guess there's different session numbers, guided programs, we've got that British spelling. Um, we have guided sleeps, relaxation shorts, music, 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 I guess by different artists is my guess. Got soundscapes, that's under the My Audio tab. You can go to My History, see what you've done, I guess, is my guess. Um, when they add sleep data, I guess that's not active right now, but it will be added and you'll be able to see it here. And then your settings, you can see your account information, um, privacy, data processing, configuration. You can, oh, here's the option to fade out audio when you fall asleep. That's cool. Introducing white noise when you take off headphones, what it'll do. I guess there will be an option coming soon to turn off your headphones 15 minutes after you've detected they're off your head. That's cool. And you've got help, feedback, what's new, and then the intro video. So all that's left is to try this, try this out, finally use it.